would be if he literally never Ever. played the hero and just like crushes That's all like the way. That's like Dendi at TI1. Like, I've never played Enigma, just put me on this hero. I'll... Um. Fury and Tusk. These heroes don't really have ways of dealing with Slark during the mid late game. It's very hard for them because he can just get in and out of the fight so fast. He's extremely mobile. And once he gets a certain threshold to farm, so you see a roll here. Oh, puppy. He's got to be careful and this is his first showing as the Earth Spirit and it might be the first death here for Secret as it looks like it will be. First blood for Liquid. The first time Puppy dies in competitive there is Earth Spirit. Yeah, that was, um... It's a little bit strange. I'm pretty sure he had vision too because it's daytime. We can see Envy still being pressured here in the safe lane as well. This is a really rough lane actually, even in a 2v1. Nice stun onto mind control, Envy, he's got the pounce, obviously Poppy, oh, misses the slow and Envy misses the jump. The crowd are loving it. Secret, not so much as mind control slips through their fingers. Damage as well because of the pure damage from that orb. I think Liquid are feeling pretty good about themselves right now. In Jarex's position, he, he does not want Misery to find much from this side camp. The Iron Talon Bird is not going to be much use, but there's nothing to use it on Jarex. Each and every time coming in, needs to be a bit careful. Now Misery. He should find the space here to finish off the, the Smasher, Jarex. Okay, now Puppy hits on point this time. There's the slow there, and with that, oh, nice escape from Jarex. Tries to look to deny himself here, but he ends up killing the Smasher. And off the back of that secret, they will kill him. Misery with the kill onto Jarax. And Puppy, he turns up and he's on point that time. <laughs> Alright. Oh, he might hey, get shot blocked here. He might pay with his life here. Let's see what he can do. Can he get himself out of this one, Puppy? It's, it's, doesn't look like it will. Yeah, there's a telekinesis. And he's going to be able to roll that. And Puppy, oh, Faith Bolt to the back. Bobta had a lot of confidence in his teammates there. He was just like, yeah, I'm, you guys are fine. You got this kill. I, I believe in you. I'm just going to chill here and keep in creeps. But nonetheless, you can't argue. Puppy certainly catching the attention of Team Liquid and, and making space around the map for his team. It does give a little bit of time for Misery to get a little bit of farm in. He did get that one oh, kill. Oh, there's Spotted Kuroki coming around here for this one. A secret. They're ready to trap him in from all sides. Tried to come in for a bit of a warding mission, but he will pay with his life there. And that's very nice here for Weeha, able to step away from the mid. Just to jump out there, do an escape. There's a lot of heroes coming through here. We'll get the Shadow Dance off. TP is available. What you can't use at the moment. The Sanity is going to get oh, dropped incredibly gone. early, but they'll punch him up and they will bring him down. A lot of hate for the Slark there. But it is absolutely required from Liquid. I think he actually still had time to TP if he did it immediately after the Snowball hit, but... Okay, kind of lame. We'll see, yeah, but after cancelling the roll, Puppy's going to try and go for the TP out, but uh, it's not going to be there in time. Too much damage with the Spirit Siphon and the right clicks. Yeah. It was a really nice Sanity's Eclipse, by the way, from a Tomb of Man. It wasn't really for the damage as much as it was to just remove all of Slark's mana. Because if you do that, then he has no escape mechanism left. You can't Dark Pack, you can't Pounce Away, you can't TP. You're pretty much just dead to rights at that point if you can't abuse Hog. Let's see how much Liquid could do with this exorcism. I'll find the tier 2. See if they could do anything as they go up to the high ground. Top lane, Misery. That has been caught out by Liquid. Matuma Man and Jerex are there. It was for a little bit of a split push, but he pays with his life. They'll take down the Beastmaster and do a significant amount of damage here to tier 3 mid. We are coming in with the defense, moving on to Mind Control. Nice silence for Fano onto Pi and Envy. Envy moving in with the Shadow Blade. Jump straight onto Step Robert. They will lose Pi on the Lion, though. A secret look for the cleanup here. They'll find that problem. Mind Control will be able to TP out. Losing the Lion, but getting that very, very valuable Death Prophet kill. It's still a very close early game here. I think it's... Rax now exposed in the mid lane. and still 10 seconds without Puppy on the defense. Let's see how much that they could do here, Liquid. Necro 3 now picked up by Misery. Secret needs to find a big opening to jump in. You can see Envy trying to wrap around the back. But they've already dropped a sentry here, Liquid, on the high ground. So it's going to be hard for Envy to catch them out if he comes too close. Dump from Puppy on the side. They're following up into the Superman. Big with one and Envy. Trying to pick up the weak at the back. Go for Groki. Definitely well spent through here. They're going to find one. They're finding Superman. Weak with Groki. Trying to in the trees defensively, but it doesn't matter. Envy still closes in, takes it down. They'll lose Puppy, though. The magnetize. He gets it out of time. He's doing a hell of a lot against Liquid. Spider falls as well. Three dead on the side of Liquid Jarex. Pops back the shards. Trying to get himself out of this one, but Envy will chase this down by the looks of it. 
Looking to see if he can find a fourth pick off for Secret. Really secure the success of this team fight. And it looks like he will. The Snowball coming forward, but the Dark Pack timing is there. And Envy turns around, takes down the Tusk. Double kill for Slark. Suddenly now sitting on 3.6k gold. They'll lose the range racks. Melee racks still stand, and that's exactly what Secret needed. Now, a Tuba Man just gets annihilated before he can even pop BKB. At that stage, Liquid would have already lost a team fight. Like, they can't win without their OD. It's just not the initiation that they needed at all. They did get the melee racks down to about half HP, got the ranged. They're gonna spot him with the ward here. So it'll be a big kill. Fodder's gonna make sure he gets that silence in in time, and while well, with the stunter set up, they'll pull it through the silence, and now with the side foot, they'll chase that down. No escape for the Invoker. And that's uh, gonna be down for 60 seconds. Does have buyback here, and I'm sure Liquid I'd be very happy if they're able to try and force that out from the side of Secret. Envy now. Seeing if he can lead it from the back. They do have a sentry down, so they will see him coming in. But in fact, it's going to be Envy jumping straight away onto Batuma Man. He'll smash himself defensively. Jarrett's trying to come in and force him back. He's got the dust. Envy silenced up. Can't get the Shadow Dance out. Envy could be in trouble. He is just taken down. That sentry there, ready and waiting for him to look for that greedy wraparound. Massive, massive thing for that side of Liquid. And now they might even be able to force uh, out too. Finger straight out to Fada, but he pops the BKB. Exorcism still up, and Poppy's been silenced. Punched up into the air and falls straight down. They'll get a triple kill as well as Matumba Man pummels onto Pylite Eye on the side. On. And Liquid suddenly finding all the momentum they need. They break the tier 3 here in the top lane. Now, Secret, they do have a buyback on Envy. They're holding us to buy back on Weeha. He'll be up in 10 seconds anyway. But they're going to need to surmount a huge base defense because there's not going to be much of it left. They've already lost the top melee racks. They're going to lose the mid ones by the looks of it as well. Ranged are already gone in both of the lanes. And Liquid, just like that. Just. That, I, I, I don't know what that was. That was so bizarre. Like, okay, Envy dies, but he has buyback. Right, here we go. Let's here see we go. Let's see what they can do at the back of this one. Jax is going to double himself up. Envy jumping in with the dark pack. The Shadow Dance as well, but he's been sprouted up. It's too much. He's trapped in the trees. But Tumor Man drops his hand. He's just into the buyback on Misery. They brought out Envy. Envy is going to get himself out of it, and he will. Now Puppy jumps in with a huge magnetize into three. Jarek silenced up the takedown to Jarek's Tusk. Mind Control being chased down as well with the right click to punches the axis from Misery. He's trying to juke it out in Mind Control, but he won't be able to get himself away. Oh, he's going to live for a bit of time. Here at the moment, Parda goes down in the trees. They do still get the kill onto Mind Control, so they'll lose four on the side of Liquid. But Secret, two sets of racks down. That is not a situation that they saw themselves being in a couple of minutes ago. I don't understand how that just unfolded so quickly. It's like one hero gets picked, your core has buyback, Envy pulled pretty much the entirety of Liquid back away from the base, and if he dies. But off the back of it, the worst thing that the Secret wanted there. They may lose Roshan, and as you said, this is going to be massive for Liquid. MV. Okay, that's a freebie. That's a freebie, and it's a big one. 50 seconds, no touch. They can go on this. Oh, Kuroki getting shot forward. Puppy's there, coming in as well. They call Kuroki out on the side, and he's going to go down. That's a really dead. Now, let's see if MV gets there back in. There's a huge stun for Pi. Also, the Summer Man finds the Puppy getting for MV. See the upper stand. He gets charged up. The side is one of the reasons. Oh, oh, it's definitely oh, one for we are. Let's go down by control. Just strike up MV left. The boy who lived, eternal MV. And we are at his back just at the time it was needed. Fantastic combo from the Evoker coming down that choke point. A secret to it. They'll move into Roach, they'll finish it off. They'll get themselves the Aegis. And what a game two we've got here, Andy. Hi, and we played that so well. They say, MV, you might be position one, but let me carry that for you. Let me, let me just get that. Pi blinks, disjoints an auto attack, but doesn't blink. Oh, that's a right. Nah, this is your that's abyssal. abyssal blade. It's your abyssal. Yeah, that is definitely an abyssal blade. MV. Not like this, MV. Just, Come yeah, on. just walk by. <laughs> Keep walking. My heart can't handle that. Oh, so. oh, oh, oh. I don't think my heart can handle that. Okay. Okay. We are in. Uh, oh god. Oh. I, I was like positive he wasn't buying a rapier. I was so sure I mean, that was going to be an abyssal blade. Oh. Oh god. Oh, MV. MV. Okay. Oh no, he misses the jump. He shouted out his up straight away. The wall onto Pada. They're looking to take down the death bullet. But now the stall roll for Kuroki comes for over his head. And even Poppy's there for the son of the beast. Oh, the real death and he goes. The massive Hanukkah's coming through. 
three dead on the side of Liquid. The fighting British one, an MV staying strong. Four down, Uduro, the last of four. Dancing around with Puppy in the ring, but a slow stress three to go down before Puppy dies. They're all dead on Liquid. It was a buyback from my control, but you've got to look at the buyback statuses and it's not good. No buyback available for Kuroki, no buyback available for Cherex, and no buyback available for Matumba Man. That rapier. Oh, moon shard as well. They're going for the base. Oh, dude. it's going to make short work of the base. This is backdoor bump, bump, protected. Bump, Look bump, at the bump, damage. Bump. <laughs> Liquid. They might have time for one more fight in this. Oh my god. But it's going to have to be a huge one. Look at that. That damage. Incredible. They got 20 seconds. I think they can get this and get out. Oh, oh they definitely can. Lie. Bye, lie, die. This man with the setup, the fingers and everything coming out to all the die back. Oh, hello. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh. Okay. That's okay. Secret just pulling out the moves this game. I really think at some point. You kind of have to just give credit to Eternal Envy and say, if nothing else, he always puts on a show for an extra rapier in case Envy loses his, right? It's true. Okay, so in bad Envy, he's going in for the BKB, turns towards Kroji, Kroji's got the Ghost Scepter. Envy was the plan, we ask come through as well, drop the ice, down the middle of the orbit, come around, it's going into the oh oh Envy eating through the side of Liquid, one, two, double kill as he takes down Jarex, and now he's chasing out Fire as well. They get the heads up, the stun from Puppy, Envy comes in, GG is called! 2-0 to Secret and MV does it with a boy with a rapier slug. Look at the engines there in the booth. They can't quite the Secret. I don't think a lot of people would have believed this coming into this tournament. People talked about potential of disbanding, but no, Secret, they've come back as strong as ever. 2-0 against Liquid, a team that was really starting to get their form this tournament and a team that they very might well meet again in the Grand Finals because that is where Secret's going to be going. They will be your first confirmed grand...